Hi, this is Maya. Welcome to my plan with me for October 1st through the 7th. I'm a little bit late uploading this. Um, honestly, I've had a cold and uh, I'm all better, but I still have a bit of a cough. So it's been a while since I thought I would be up to... Um, <clears throat> To doing an upload. So I'm first of all showing my, it's like a mini haul here from my Simply Gilded order that I did for the uh, um, autumn colors, I guess. Um, those three are all rose gold. Um, there was mustard um, and there was like dark teal and, uh, and it was like a burgundy. And then the last one was blue with hollow foil. And um, I'm just showing the last like little card that she sent with her last order. And I'm going to do the same thing later on in my bullet journal, probably in November for the one that she sent with this one. So this is the washi I'm going to use with this spread. It's the mustard um, color with the rose gold foil. And I'm just picking out some Tombos um, that I think would go well with that. I usually like to have about five and then I also showed at the beginning my uh, rose gold uh, gel pen which was a zebra I think. Was it a zebra? I think it was a zebra and then also I have a black one which is also zebra and um, I showed you my little Tombow brush pen and um, a Sharpie extra fine line. So I put my washi at the end of the page um, and kind of overlap it a little bit so that it's like really easy to flip to the week. Makes a little page turner and I really love the way it looks uh, at the end of the bullet journal when it's just like... I don't know, I use a different bullet journal for each season, and so this one at the end will be all autumn colored, and I like seeing all the washies. It's just really pretty. So I count about nine squares across for each day, and I'm still messing with how I want the colors to bleed into each other. Um, they honestly don't work so well when I'm using dark colors. Um, which a lot of my autumn colors are dark colors and I keep trying to mix light colors with dark colors and it keeps not really turning out. So I got to figure out still how I'm going to make this work. I might just have to do solid colors. I might have to go back to uh, dribbling water on the page with my watercolor brush. So we'll just see. I don't particularly have a rhyme or reason to the um, order of the colors that I'm using. I try to go through them uh, a little bit systematically so that I know, uh, so that I'm like using them equally and that they're spaced apart. But um, whether I use like three colors in a day or two colors, um, just whatever I feel like. So yeah, I think it's the last time I'm going to be doing it like this. It, in the end, it's usually mostly covered with stickers anyway, so it makes more of a backdrop for them. But um, some of the days were short this week, so a lot of it was showing, and I just didn't really like the way it looked, so I'm going to try and do a little bit better next week. I was gone for a few weeks at the end of August and the beginning of September. I um, did a three-week road trip across the country from the West Coast to almost the East Coast. I went to Vermont from Seattle, and it was amazing. It was so much fun. It was just me and my music and my new car, and it was just like, it was just a blast. And I sing my little heart out every day in my car because I love I love music. I'm not a particularly good singer or anything like that, but I'm telling you, 
<laughs> singing that much. Um, my voice definitely got a little better at least. Um, so that was really fun. But then I, after I got home, I got sick pretty immediately. And I just haven't been able to keep up with, um, just haven't had the energy really to do filming or editing. Because not only did I have, um, not only was I sick, but I also had a lot of catch up to do in my home life. And, and it's like, autumn doesn't really slow down for me like it does for a lot of people, especially in October, because it's my husband's birthday month. And uh, our anniversary is this month. And um, I like to do like a mini retreat uh, every season. And then also, um, I have like an extra retreat plan because uh, I already like bought it uh, months ago. And I kind of wish I wouldn't have, but I know I'm going to have a lot of fun um, just because I'm also so busy and I'm actually kind of a homebody. So it's like I'm doing all of these things, but it's like it, it does wear me out a little bit. But also it's like I always enjoy them and it's always like really good experiences. And I always get to spend time with really wonderful people. So I can't complain. I really shouldn't complain because I'm really lucky. And, um, yeah, it's a privilege for sure. So I've colored all my days and then I'm going to go in with, uh, quarter boxes for, um, the tops of the, for the date covers is what I'm trying to say. Um, I think I'm going to add that all of the foil color that I use in this kit is going to be rose gold. Um, so it can match the washi. Um, I'm not going to go, cause I, I like to use a little bit of a variety of stickers and shapes and colors and designs. I like, obviously I want them to match, but, um, it's too hard for me to like announce which, <laughs> who made each sticker as it comes on the screen. So if you have any questions, please comment down below and I will, um, find out for you. So I would say that I would like to get back into a habit of uh, making, editing, and uploading Plan With Me's, but I know I'm going to be gone uh, the next two weekends, so that's not really going to work. Hopefully by December, I'll have a routine again. I uh, After the end of, by the end of October, I should be home <laughs> for a, a while like I think I don't have my next thing scheduled until like January so hopefully I'm staying at home for Christmas this year um my friends and um we every year we trade back and forth whose house we celebrate Christmas at and so this year it's our house <clears throat> so those are my newest addiction little date dots Rose gold, rose gold foil, like I said. I can't believe it's already October. It's blowing my mind. It still feels like the beginning of 2018 for me. This year has been nuts. I love strawberry lime designs. Uh, glitter headers I think they're so pretty they're almost like a I don't know they remind me almost of like sugar they're just so pretty such like clean colors I just love them
That's Rose Colored Days, the Hello October sticker. And I'm getting out my, well, there's my drink. I had a nice hot chocolate. Um, my stickers that I need for that day. I'm trying to get back into a routine of working out three times a week. And since I, like, I was still feeling a little bit iffy getting over my cold last week. So just going for a little walk around my neighborhood is what I'm doing right now. Actually playing Pokemon Go um, because that actually motivates me to get out there. Um, today I actually caught a, a one that I'd never caught before, so that was fun. Um, but eventually I'd like to... Um, just like have like a real workout every day or not every day, but Monday, Wednesdays and Fridays. Um, oh yeah. I was started Monday and then I realized I didn't write down any of the days of the week. That pen that I was just using is my pilot, uh, Prera. And then the ink I have in there is, um, Yamabudo by uh, Iroshizuko. I hope I didn't pronounce that wrong. Well, I'm sure I pronounced it wrong. I hope I didn't pronounce it too badly. I use a lot of kit leftovers. Um, last year I had an Erin Condren and I uh, filled almost the whole thing with memory spreads. Um, and this year I just decided not to because um, for one thing, it would be nice to get like any kind of an upload schedule going um, and having like regular plan with me's and memory spreads. is just a lot of time, especially since I have a new job now and I'm thinking about starting school next year. So I'm going to be having less time. So yeah, Monday I volunteer at the aquarium Ginger Cat Co. makes that really cute little half box, and it's got uh, rose gold foil on the outside. Of course, you can choose different foil colors, but it has a little bow in the corner, and it's so cute. And then while I'm at the aquarium, we have a cleaner who comes to visit, and then I put the little scallop half, half moon um, from Panda Bird Design. In that evening, I was meeting um, one of my good friends for tea, and it's been a long time, like, I haven't seen her since, well, I'd seen her, but I hadn't really, like, spent any time with her since the spring. So it was wonderful to reconnect. We were both exhausted, but it was really nice. I love those little workout <laughs> stickers um, by um, Once More With Love, with their little butts sticking out. They're just so cute. I can't stand how cute they are. Looks like I'm messing with my phone. I can't remember what I was looking for. So Tuesday, um, landscapers came uh, in the morning, which I like to note in my journal so I can remember to not open the bedroom curtains before I get dressed because that's always a fun surprise. And then I have therapy after that. I think my newest addiction makes those little, there's like a sheet of half, like more like third boxes and quarter boxes with foil and lots and lots of different colors. And then a reminder to myself to make sure I clean out the litter box. I try to do it every day or every other day, but after the weekend is usually like, usually gets skipped. And so I like have to make sure I get it done as soon as possible. And then I have an art project I'm working on. I want to make sure I do that regularly every week. Those little cooking stickers I uh, got from Pip Sticks, um, which I don't subscribe to anymore. I subscribed to them for a year. It was really fun. But I kind of decided that those colors are too bright and neon for this. So I put them away. I'll probably take them out again in the spring. I'm like really intense with the colors I use each season. I've, it's kind of funny to other people, I guess. I made a really good dinner that night. By the way, I'm I I filmed this plan with me on Saturday, the uh, September 30th. Oh, here's my cat. If he starts meowing, I apologize, but it might just sound really cute because he's an adorable kitty. 
he's also very needy. I forgot what I was talking about. Mm -hmm. Hi. <laughs> oh, that's right. The dinner I made that night um, was really good. I made like a vegetable, kind of like a, almost like a ratatouille kind of thing, except just whatever looked good at the store with some bacon. And then I also cooked a little pork tenderloin and put that on top. It's really good. My husband loved it. I think he liked it more than I did, which is unusual to be honest. He's usually a lot more picky than I am. Yeah. I wanted like a little reminder sticker at the bottom of the page. Cause my husband's usually away on Tuesday nights. Um, but this week he was going to be away on Wednesday night instead. So I wanted to note that he was actually going to be home that night because I'm used to him not being there. So I couldn't find, like, I didn't want to do another reminder sticker because there was one at the top of the page. So I think that leaf is pretty cute. It was from, I don't know, it's deco from some kit I used last year. Anyway, I'm recording this voiceover, and it's Wednesday night right now. Wednesday is usually my day to do all of the, like, house chores. I do laundry and, like, do some budgeting and any paperwork I have, stuff like that. Order groceries online sometimes or just sundries from Amazon or whatever. My cat is like bonking his head on my laptop right now. Such a silly. I'm happy because I'm looking at my, uh, the list of things I wanted to do that day. And I'm like, yes, I have done all of these. I feel pretty good. Well, except for the end of the day, I'm remembering I, um, I'm about to put down these pottery stickers I ordered. Um, I can't remember who makes them, but they're um, a shop where you can just like put in what you want it to say. I think Rose Colored Days used to do that before she got really busy. Um, and I feel, I feel sad because I just ordered those pottery stickers and I've been using them the last few weeks, but I haven't made it to one pottery class. And I finally just decided that I had to quit um, because I don't have the energy or the time right now. Um, since I started working in the evenings, I work Thursday through Sunday nights. 
um, unless I have a date night or something like that. I really need to, I really need to at least try and get an extra day if I have to skip one of the weekend days because I just really need, really need the money. <clears throat> So I'm picking out my Thursday stickers. Mm -hmm. Ah, yes. Tomorrow morning I have an eye exam. Actually, it's not in the morning. It's in the afternoon. And then I have homework um, from my therapist. And then I also have a friend who's a life coach. Um, and she needs to... Um, get her hours, um, her practice hours on people. So um, she she gives me a little life coaching on the side. So um, they both, either one or the other gives me homework. But what I need to do is actually, um, since I'm thinking about going back to school next year, um, I want to work on my essay. Sorry. He was annoyed with the way I was petting him. <laughs> I have to figure out what to make for dinner tomorrow night. I still have no idea. I looked up some recipes online and pretty much decided that I didn't want to make any of those. It's just hard. I've gotten really bored with cooking, and I hate following recipes, to be honest. It's annoying. I don't know what it is with my cats lately, but they've been like super energetic and like they've been fighting more than usual, which isn't good. I mean, I always stop them, but um, I think I just a little scab on my kitty's nose. It makes me sad. So Friday, I'm going to the chiropractor. Uh, try, especially after being sick, it really helps me to get my system in order. And then that evening, um, I'm going out with my husband and uh, two friends um, to a bar. And then we're going to come back to our house and play games. So Saturday, I'm picking out, these are my planner stickers from Happy Daya. Um, I'm going to have a date night that night. And I'm getting my hair done, which is good. It's getting kind of shaggy right now. I really want to get some new lighting for my videos. I am using like warm light on one side and cool light on the other side because I don't have a lot of either. And I really just want to get some really good just white natural light I kind of wish I would have cut that sticker down a little bit because I don't have enough room <clears throat> later to um, write in what my husband and I are going to be doing for date night that night but that afternoon um, our friend Lacey is coming over she's helping us redecorate our house because she's awesome I was going to use one of those little house stickers on that, but since I found a sticker with houses on it, I figured I didn't really need to. So I'm going to spend a little bit of time planning that afternoon. I'm going to try really hard to um, get that uh, edited and uploaded before Monday. We'll see how that goes.
So Sunday, I'm planning on doing the voiceover and then uploading it. Hopefully I get this in frame in a second here. Okay, so that's it for the actual days. And then I'm going to be putting down, I'm going to be doing a little next week's section because it's always good to look ahead. I'm trying to find a header that won't look too busy. It's a pretty good little space right there for it. going out with my aquarium friends after my shift next Monday. And then I'm going on my soul dust retreat. And that will be, technically it will be Wednesday through Sunday. Um, but my friend offered to buy me a massage. Um, there's someone, I think it's in Portland, that um, does massage while you float in a tank. Um, and she says it's amazing. And she's like a really, really good massage therapist. So... I feel like if she says it's good, then it's going to be amazing. Um, so I'm going to do a little checklist of kind of the main things I want to do. And, <laughs> excuse me, what I had been doing was just putting a few of them across the bottom, but it's been really hard for me to stay organized. So what I, I didn't feel myself doing this, but after... Um, after this like weekly overview, then the next couple of pages, I'll do like a little daily. Um, um, and then just have like write the two to do's for the day ahead of time for the whole week so that I don't miss out on stuff. So I put a little strip of some more simply gilded washi. It's like uh, burgundy with uh, rose gold, like a little like, I don't know, vine with hearts. It's really cute. And I'm looking for like a full box and then I end up with this cute little um, Autumn Fox Deco sticker that I got from an Autumn kit last year. So that is my spread for the week. I hope you enjoy and I will see you in my next video. Hopefully that's sooner rather than later. Bye bye.